Do you say XRP is a security? Well, we're in uh, uh, court and active uh, discussions and litigation on that. You're in okay, what do people say about XRP? We talked about this the other day, but let's get the latest in the upcoming conclusion to the XRP SEC case. And you saw our friend Gary Gensler, there, a little smirk on his face. Does that boy look nervous to you? Well, he certainly does to me. Let's break it down in this video, so be sure to subscribe to the channel. Also, if you like this content and you hold an XRP, smash the like button. It gets us up in the old algorithm, lets people know that the YouTube and XRP army are here to stay. But let's get into it. So, taking a quick look at the price, we will come back and take a look at it. We did break back up into the 46 range, testing this nine day EMA. Really good to see. We want to see this push up towards that 46.30 mark and break into this level of support. And then we can trade in this channel. Obviously, we want to start to move up into the 47s and potentially even back up to that 50 cent mark. Now, we're going to need market sentiment to move with us. But currently, XRP, we just tipped into a new day or coming up to a new day, about half a percent down here, but two solid green candles on the four hour chart. So looking, uh, looking a bit more bullish as we kind of go through this chart. But what is the latest we've got from the case? Well, this is the latest update as of the 24th of April 2023. It says that the cryptocurrency sector is still on the edge of the seat waiting for the judge to pass the final decision. Is widely publicized lawsuit between Ripple and the United States Securities and Exchange Commission. Regulatory uncertainty has already started to affect the blockchain company's business and it's starting with the XRP community. What's this talking about? It says, indeed Ripple's newest product, Liquidity Hub, lacks support for XRP causing outrage among part of the XRP community. So they've launched this new Liquidity Hub product and it isn't supporting XRP, but just to be really clear on that, so as having said that, Alderity confirmed that in the future there might still be support for the cryptocurrency, stating that we are keen to support XRP and Liquidity Hub when we can provide a good customer experience. Seemingly, the lawyer was hinting at the possibility of introducing XRP after the court decision in the Ripple versus SE case brings more clarity to the sector. And I think that's really important. Right now, the last thing XRP need to do is start to bring Ripple into other products that could be deemed as a potential security or even give the SEC fuel to go after it. I've talked about this in a number of XRP videos and I still stand by the fact I think XRP will win the court case. And I think when you look at Gary Gensler's body language, even to the point when you look at the smirk on his face, he knows the gig's up. He knows XRP right now is not his battle to win. And that's why I think we're seeing him going after things like Coinbase. We're seeing him things going after things like Kraken. It's a gigantic money grab and that's not going to be the case with XRP. Now, it does continue. It says, while the XRP at the prime of, uh, excuse me, while meanwhile, XRP was at a press time changing hands, the price of 46 down 1.9% of the day. We know that's now come back up across previous seven days, but still holding the 8.47% increase in its price in the last month. So still continuing to be pretty strong on the overall price. Like I said, we wait for Annalisa Torres, the judge residing over this case, to bring that announcement. I talked about this the other day. We are expecting it within the next two weeks based on her previous cases and how long it takes to deliberate over it. And I think it could be incredibly bullish for both XRP and the wider cryptocurrency market. Now, lawyers are wading in on this, as you would expect. Everyone has an opinion based on XRP. And Bill Morgan coming out there, he is a Ripple lawyer, recently tweeted a scenario where the situation could end up being good for Ripple. Now, I've talked about this also that I think even if Ripple were to lose, which I don't think will happen, it still could come out as very good for XRP. He states, Morgan stated that if only the court finds Ripple liable for XRP sales up to 2015 and does not make an order to stop future sales on ODL customers, it would be a good result for Ripple. Says Morgan also covered the possibility that the SEC may not obtain a permanent injunction on future Ripple XRP sales. This is due to the fact that the current XRP sales are to ODL customers who are not investors. Also, don't expect profits from XRP sales. What does that mean? Well, ultimately, there is a couple of different outcomes that could come with XRP. Namely, we could even see XRP lose the case, but not have an injunction based on its sales of those XRP tokens, which could be a very positive thing in the future. And I think, what does this do? This ultimately sets out a precedent that right now there is a view that the you know SEC is aggressively camping down on cryptocurrency. We know that we've got places like Japan, Europe, as well as a number of other countries welcoming these cryptocurrency projects and investment businesses to their countries because there is a lot of money in cryptocurrency and there will be even more as the market starts to move up. So I think it's a very smart thought from Bill Morgan. And finally, in terms of the price, we are seeing that crucial 50 cent support loss last week, but 
Behind the scenes, cluster of large investors holding a million to 10 million XRP have been buying the dip. Now, we talked about this on my live stream. We know that whales are accumulating at some of these prices. Yes, we are seeing some of them sell, but ultimately the top tier the big whales are buying even more it says current market price of the four six new added xrp coins are worth 36 million dollars a positive divergence between price and buying trends among whales could be a crucial indicator of impending price rebound so we definitely could see a pretty strong bounce up on xrp very very soon and actually when you take a look at the chart given the fact we've turned green for the day and what we're seeing is an increase in volume about 11.67 million xrp sold just today so excuse me sold in the previous last eight hours we could start to see a strong move up in that price again testing this 46 range and then heading on back up to the 50 cent range but let me know in the comments down below what do you think when do you think we'll get the latest court case i'm certainly interested to hear what you guys think but for me super excited about ripple i think there's some very smart people with some very good decision making and some very view uh, very interesting outlooks on exactly what could happen with xrp it's big for crypto it's big for xrp it's going to be big for Gary Gensler as well. So let me know in the comments down below. As ever, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for your latest and greatest in XRP content as well as the cryptocurrency market. And check some of the links in the description. We've just partnered up with BitGet, a fantastic exchange with some great products over there and always Mexi supporting the channel. So check out those two links in the description. Have a look. Thank you so much. See you in the next video.